And so we're in the last 12 hours of 2020. In uh, Australia, there's only about 10 minutes of 2020 left. Well, uh, uh, I say Australia, Sydney, Australia. <laughs> um, because it depends where in the world you are at what time midnight comes. Anyway, uh, enough of that. I did, uh, I did uh, some news on Notre Dame yesterday, so I, I better check the voice uh, app. OK, Google, talk to Restoring Notre Dame. All right, here's the test version of Restoring Notre Dame. Hi, you're from Restoring Notre Dame. We have almost daily updates. What do you want to do? Say help if you're not sure. What is the update today? Enter a date, please, or specify today. Today. A simple response is cool. Your given date is the 31st of December 2020. The closest we have is Notre Dame restoration workers uncover medieval colours. It has the date the 30th of December 2020. Read more at restoringnotredame.com. Say more for the story or get the update for another date or maybe say you're done. More. And some more, the story for Notre Dame restoration workers uncover medieval colours is the need to build scaffolds up to 40 metres high for the 200 workers to repair the high walls and soaring boards has given art restorers the opportunity to study up close the side chapel ceilings they had no access to before. They are finding traces of rich polychromatic decorations under the dark levels that have built up over centuries of candle smoke and air pollution. Medieval cathedrals were often covered inside and out with paint that either wore off or was hidden as unfashionable in later eras. We found blues, reds, ochres, lilies with some gilding and others whose traces are preserved in negative, chief heritage curator Jonathan Trulet told the Daily La Croix. Read more at restoringnotredame.com. Get the update for another date or you can say you're done. OK, I'm done. OK, see what's new on restoringnotredame.com tomorrow. And with a kiss from Precious, that's my video <laughs> for today. Uh, happy last day of 2020.